Hey, what's up? Frank here at Voodoo Studios. We're diving into the exclusive orange collection inside Amplitude 5. We've got Amplitude 5 Max with everything they offer, and we're gonna dive in and see some of these recreations of classic orange amplifiers. They've got all the orange stuff here. They've got orange bass, fully configurable cabinets. Looks like a big 15, yeah, 15 inch woofer on there, ported. But you could still swap out the cab, so you can just go to your collection, speaker, Anything with multiple speakers and you can swap out the speaker. But let's start with the amps. First one's the 8030. Right away. Just cuts through. Not harsh, just good mid-range crunch. Nothing fancy on it. Now this amp, you could tell, you push the mid-range on it. Not just an EQ character. Amp actually breaks up differently. The Tiny Terror we got behind me, we use that amp almost every day. Always finds its place on a record. Incredible range of tone when it comes to sweeping the gain. It gives you a lot of options for really subtle breakup, good chord definition, but a lot of size. You know, big guitar sounds are really hard to get, especially when you're using too much gain. So an amplifier that sounds good with a medium amount of gain like the Tiny Terror always sounds beautiful. Put it full on. It'll compress, but right down. Tiny Terror, that's why we got one. And if you can't get one, now you can. Let's see what the Dual Terror does. Uh, let's check out the, the fat channel on this. Wow, I like that, that's, that's some good hairiness. Next up we got the OR50. Or also known as a very, very dark, thick sounding amp. Surprisingly clear for how, how dark and thick it is but I would say this is definitely a strong candidate for single note. Yeah, really sustaining. The rocker verb, orange rocker verb 50 Mark II. I know this amp very well has seen many a record that I've done and uh, always appreciate how easily it fits into a mix. Always carves its place right, doesn't give you anything you don't need. It sounds like it's going through a 212 right now. What is it going through? It's going through a 212. Right on. Pull that back a little bit. Now, let's give it a little more condenser actually. Of course, just gobs of reverb if you want. Awesome selection of amps, really the cream of the, uh, the orange crop. Plenty of chunk in this one. And this guitar really sings too. It's kind of it's kind of hard not to have fun playing this. It, I just want to play big open chords on it. I know like I should be shredding, but that's really just not my thing. These orange amps sound huge, and I just want to hit every string at the same time. Yeah. 
Yeah, a lot of fun to move chords around. Great mid-range for an amp that has no mid-range control. It's just, it's just well-voiced. And it definitely, definitely helpful to tell you, it seems like this is the resonant frequency of the upper mids that it's showing you here. 3.4K, so that's sort of the, the drive. And that's sort of the, the frequency select. So it's almost like a parametric EQ. If you're familiar with gain boosts and frequency selection, it kind of lets you hone in on the spot of the amp and then push it. Let's check out the Thunderverb 200. Definitely a conservative amp at 200. <laughs> this one I've had the good fortune of using and got to toy around with it and has some really cool tone shaping options, especially on, yeah, channel B, right? It's just the sort of like the filter control, single tone knob instead of the three band. You can tell it's got plenty of bottom, plenty of headroom. So we're going to open it up a little bit. Guitar's open, straight up. Very nice hall-like reverb in this amp, so you could probably do some great lead stuff with it. I'm gonna try a different cab on this and see how it behaves with a 112. Try the speaker combinations. Orange cabinets are built like tanks, you know. They've got great speakers in them. They handle a lot of sound pressure. They, they handle whatever you put into them. You just gotta pick the right one. So we just finished demoing through the orange amps real quick and seriously stoked on the sound quality. The Amplitude 5 sounds impeccable. I highly recommend checking out these amps.